Hey guys, what's up? It's Hijabi Reviews here. I'm very sorry that I didn't post another YouTube video. I've been just very, 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 very busy doing a lot of things and going a lot of places. And I unfortunately cannot post any Canada Day or 4th of July uh, fireworks uh, videos because I didn't end up actually taking any videos. I was busy doing something and then I decided to stop what I was doing um, to watch the fireworks without recording them. So, it's been a couple days now, obviously, um, where I am at, all the trailers and everything is already gone, so, and they packed up all the circus and whatnot, and, um, the carnival, so all that's all over with, so unfortunately there will be minimal to no, um, entertainment of that nature for, until next year, so that kind of sucks, so, um, right now I'm just chilling at home and uh you know kind of waiting on a response from rogers telecommunications because they're responsible for yet again another um internet and telephone service outage and um i'm not with rogers i'm with bell but um i cannot reach any person that i want to reach because everybody i know has rogers so I don't know what's going on right now, and Bell has not, you know, found a way to, like, or sorry, not, not Bell. <laughs> Rogers has not made their way in any effort since early this morning, um, I think past 12 a.m. to make an effort to fix the problem, so I don't know what's going on right now. And it kind of sucks. Uh, I don't know what's going on, and it's really... It's very angering to me that Rogers thinks they can do stuff like this and get away with it. So my advice to everybody, including myself, is to make the switch. <sighs> Definitely make the switch from Rogers to Bell or somebody else or tell us or somebody who's going to treat you right and um, give you good service permanently and not have the internet constantly down or charging you more on your next bill or more taxes or whatever the case may be because Rogers thinks that they can get away with stuff like this and we need to show them that they cannot get away with stuff like this and this is completely and utterly illegal to do and I think they've been doing it on purpose but I'm not 100% sure so there's that and then the fact of the matter is tomorrow is Eid tomorrow's Eid the second Eid al-Adha and um Obviously, I want to make, be able to, you know, buy stuff for tomorrow and whatnot. And I don't know if I can do that because of the banks and whatnot. So, it sucks. But yeah. Hopefully, Rogers, you know, uh, fix, fixes their mistake. And if not, they should have to pay the price in full. So, yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow for an Eid vlog. So, bye-bye. Stay safe.